Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I wanted to share with you um, my Black Friday order from Troll Beats. I placed my order with my favorite store, which is Troll Beats Texas, and um, I received everything all boxed up together. I did order just a skosh more than this, um, but someone who watches my videos, um, there's a present included for her in my last order, so I'm not going to show um, those things. So <laughs> um, let me go ahead and get everything out of the box here and uh, show you what I got. So one of the things that I was looking the most forward to with the Troll Beads Black Friday sale was the Growing Love bracelet. And this is a bracelet um, that includes a lock, uh, a dangle charm, a glass bead, um, a silver bead, and then the foxtail chain. I wound up getting this uh, in a 19 centimeter. And let me show you the lock first. And this lock I can see being versatile um, throughout the year. It does have these kind of like free form, freestyle um, hearts. Like they're not perfectly symmetrical. Um, and you can see there are locks along with um, scrolls on all four sides. And uh, forgive the unpolished nails, guys. I had the best intentions today, uh, but uh, wound up going to Home Depot, um, three different Home Depots uh, for um, a Christmas tree, a new one. I'm finally getting a pre-lit uh, Christmas tree. No more stringing lights for me. Happy Christmas to me. Um, <laughs> And uh, also a new um, dish disposal or food disposal, um, whatever they're called, uh, in the sink. Um, so that took up a big part of my day. Um, then I had lunch out. So here I am filming and it's pitch black out. Uh, and I did not have time to do my nails. So forgive me in advance for that. But... Um, here is the lock. I can see this really going well um, on a Valentine's design um, with these freeform little hearts here. So that is the clasp. And then we have uh, this dangle element. And this has um, like three trailing stars. Uh, two of the stars have a star cutout, and then the bottom star, uh, the smallest one, is uh, completely solid. And um, last year, when Troll Beads released, what was it, the Poinsettia Wish, um, you could actually opt to purchase that bracelet. It also... Um, had two versions where one where you could purchase the dangle one where you could um, purchase it without and last year I opted to purchase without but um, this growing love bracelet did not give the option this year and actually it's kind of fun um, I really like this element I can really see it being used um, on kind of like a star you know a starry night uh, theme with some of um, like my darker blue uh, troll beads, like that blue gold stone, um, you know, northern lights here. Um, I think it would look really, really pretty or um, even, and hopefully these don't all fall off with like Milky Way. So, oh, even like 4th of July with the Star Spangled Beads. So, um, can be, I think, really fun and versatile. That's what I like about all of these elements on this particular bracelet. Um, 
they're going to be very versatile, I think. This um, glass bead here is very similar to, um, oh gosh, I can't even remember it now, um, Sense of Shimmer. <laughs> Um, Sense of Shimmer has a little bit more of a olive green overlay, and this is um, a brighter, uh, almost spring green, but it does have that same uh, glittery core. In fact, here is uh, Sense of Shimmer, just so you can kind of see the difference in the green. Um, I think they themselves will work really well together. But um, what's exciting about this particular bead, um, I'll show you uh, my bangle here in a second. I think it's gonna go really well with a reindeer unique um, that I purchased this year. So I'll get that bangle in a second. And then the silver bead um, is just adorable. It is these two little pine cones kind of tied up uh, with a bow. And living in Colorado, like we have pine trees um, and uh, you know, we will do things with pine cones like make crafts, bird feeders, um, door wreaths, um, little uh, little animals. Um, so pine cones are definitely something that I love and adore. So um, I really do love this entire bracelet. Um, let me show you and take off my bangle here that I'm wearing. So this is a bangle. Um, this is the ornate of green um, from last year's um, Christmas collection. This is the reindeer unique that I just purchased this year from Troll Beats Texas. Um, this little um, cherub is the, what is it, cherub of all living, I think is what it's called. This was also from last year's Christmas collection that came out with this one. And then this is um, the green goldstone, which really is pretty. Um, videos and pictures do not adequately uh, capture, but I really think, um, look at how this particular uh, glass bead with the new Growing Love bracelet pairs with the Ornate of Green. Um, it's going to pair beautifully with this Reindeer Unique. And uh, it's even going to pair beautifully with my Green Goldstone. So really, really, um, I love greens. Got that from my mom. So really, really in love with the new bracelet. The other thing that I purchased was the Shimmering Love bead. And this is uh, the Black Friday bead that Troll Beads released. Um, they do that every year. Um, last year, I think they did what? The Dragon of Power. And that is one I did not get. Although the more I think about it, um, I don't know, I might have to quickly think about getting one uh, before it's completely gone. Oh, and look at my green goldstone in the shot. Um, yeah, <laughs> it actually looks better uh, just laying still there where you can see some of that. But um, this is the Shimmering Love bead, which is this year's Black Friday bead. And I love how it has alternating rows of hearts um, on a black base. So um, you'll see that the hearts go, like you have two rows of hearts um, that are right side up, and then you have two rows of hearts, um, or maybe looks like actually three rows there. One, two, three rows of hearts that are upside down. And then, you know, it goes back to the two that are right side up. 
but it is so pretty like the hearts are outlined in white and then you have that beautiful um, coppery glitter at the center of the heart and I love um, black beads I wish troll beads made a few more but I think this will pair beautifully with my Sahara night facet and then um, this one, which was uh, from a Christmas collection a few years back, I believe it is called Golden Swirls. Um, it's going to pair beautifully with that as well. So that is this year's Black Friday bead. And then... I did treat myself to a really pretty, another pretty reindeer unique. This one um, is kind of a pinkish mauve. And as you can see, it just has a very simple uh, white stag, I guess. Maybe not necessarily a reindeer. Um, and the stag, of course, has a little black dot for its eye. And then it has like these little dots of snow. And some of the dots are kind of blue, while others are white. Um, this one is completely opaque. But I just thought this was so, so pretty. And... Um, I could not resist it. So this is a, uh, I guess, reindeer um, unique. I believe that's kind of what they're calling them. Could be wrong. And then with Troll Beats Texas, um, whenever you purchase $150 or more, you do get a free unique. And there were a total of three uniques um, that I fell in love with. I actually had my youngest son um, help me make the determination as to which one I should get. And I actually had the other two kind of set aside because, well, let's face it, I know I'm going to have another order over $150 um, probably pretty soon so <laughs> might as well set aside the ones that I like um, but this one is just really pretty um, it is this beautiful blue um, flower and as you can see like the flowers are all on the surface there like the core is pretty clear but the flower pattern um, I'm just kind of looking ahead, like I think this will look pretty on some winter designs, um, you know, January, February, March, uh, well, probably even a little bit of April here in Colorado, sometimes even May, <laughs> but um, I just thought this was really pretty, like how you have uh, the little dots there at the center of the flowers and then, you know, at each uh, petal intersection there. So this was the unique I chose. And uh, I think I see a little bit of purple there too, um, at least in this light. So that is everything that I purchased. Um, let me know your thoughts, guys. Did you get the uh, Growing Love or Shimmering Love beads this year? Have you got any of the uniques? Um, let me know. Um, thanks for watching, and I will catch you in the next one. Bye.